What's up, guys? John here. I'm Sharice. And we are back with another Type Medical Movie Review just for you. So this week we got to see dum, 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 Expendables 4. So we got to see the first three Expendables, which is pretty good. That's what's led us to this fourth one. Um, if you have never seen Expendables, it's basically uh, a whole bunch of different action you know, heroes from over the years, old and new, put together by Sylvester Stallone, which is usually the main character in these movies. You know, it was pretty good. I thought there was a lot of action. Um, There's some, some good little comedy here or there. I thought one of the characters was trying too hard. It was like Antonio Banderas' son in the movie. That's not who that was. That's who that was. Oh, yeah, that makes so, sense now. Um, you know, I, I thought that was, uh, he, that character was. Uh, yeah, he was strange. You know, yeah, he was definitely strange. You know, he tried to take Antonio Banderas' like, vibe and it just didn't work out for him that way. So, yeah. Um, that was really good though. It, it had a good plot, good storyline. You know, some of the different things you see in the beginning, you're like, oh my God, I can't believe they did this. And then in the end, they kind of like tie it all together. I think the team could have been a little bit better. I think some of the characters could have been a little bit longer. <laughs> I know what John did. Right? So, yeah, so 3.8 is what I'm going to give it. It was definitely a good movie. It wasn't any, It wasn't like any down parts or anything like that. So I think you'll like that. Okay. Um, yeah. I like the movie because I like violence. So that always comes down to I love fast cars. And I like violence. So anything that has either one of those, I do typically like it. Sylvester Stallone, I like him. And I also like Jason. Stratton. Yeah, they're both great actors. Um, 50 Cent was in there. You know, you got to mix in a nice little mix up. And, you know, Megan Fox was actually in this movie. I had no idea that there was even going to be a girl added to the Expendables because I don't believe there was any girls there, before. There has been. Ronda, oh. Ronda Rousey was in one. Oh, or Ronda a couple. Rousey. Yeah, okay, so okay. Yeah, yeah, she was part of it. But yeah, you know, Megan Fox, she's like a really pretty girl, obviously. But um, I really don't see Megan as like a, like a fighter, you know? So um, yeah, I feel like maybe she overstepped her... Uh, her, her fighter boundaries. It's a little bit of a stretch when, when you know, you're starting to see this in guys, all the guys, movies. Guys, listen. Well, there's only so much. There's only so much. Listen. We are all very independent, strong women. Yeah. But we are not going to be able to do cartwheels off the wall and then jump on top of nine guys and hit them in the face and then come out without not, not even a scratch on your beautiful face and your hair is blowing in the wind, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. I love that. It's a little unrealistic what we're starting to see <laughs> as a trend in some of these movies with the female heroine <laughs> just being so superior that, you know, a, a blow over breath and you're, you're, you're falling over. So Well, we all know that Megan Fox took over the entire team because that, you know, yeah. that's, what, that, that's what happens And now. you know what? You haven't seen Megan Fox in a lot of movies lately. Well, she right? was she was shut down after Transformers, I believe, right? Yeah. You know, Michael Bay said and she was kind of done and then she yep. got with, what's his name? The little tall blonde head dude to try to go get something. But yeah, in. so my rating is going to be roughly around a 2.9. Mm-hmm. Halfway there. Halfway you guys there. almost made it. Expendables 4. 2.9. So listen, <laughs> go out, check it out. Expendables 4, Sylvester Stallone, Jason Strata, Randy Kortcher, uh, Megan Fox, 50 Cent, uh, Dolph Lundgren. He, he's been in, I think, every single one, too, as well. Yep. So it's kind of crazy. He just needed a little alcohol at yeah. the end to get <laughs> kicking. You guys will love it. Uh, go check it out, and we'll be back with more tight medical movie reviews just for you coming soon. See you then.